everyone, it's Linksy, and today we are playing Niche again! I did actually want to go ahead and start up a whole new series. I know that we've got Shelter coming in still, but I figure, you know what, I can jungle like three series, you know? So we'll see. <laughs> I was thinking of maybe Spore Rancher, but if you guys have any recommendations, go ahead and let me know down in the comments. And with that being said, let's get started. So I hope everyone's having a good day. And if not, don't worry, it'll be okay, you know? We will find a solution together. Well, looks like it is raining, meaning we can go ahead and use this to collect some more berries. Hello, <laughs> Mr. Dodomingo. You enjoying yourself today? I bet you are. <laughs> he's so happy. I really do love the Dodomingo. I think he's very cute. Okay, let's skip the day. So I was actually really surprised about the turnout for the uh, Steam codes, actually. I was expecting like only a couple of people, you know, and I didn't expect it to be very big at all. And the fact that it was, I was like, whoa, wow, I didn't know that there was so many people. I thought that was really cool and even if you know you're just a new subscriber or you just came because you <laughs> because of the steam codes that's fine you know I'm gonna welcome everyone there were a lot of youtubers that I actually found only because of their competitions and so it's not exactly a bad thing you know we'll find something to watch eventually somehow you know however word gets spread around so welcome if you're new, and if you're old, then hi! <laughs> Alright, now let's see. Mr. Nutaku, how about you head over there with your big brothers? Yeah, most of them are big brothers, except for this little lady here, Mirasi. Or Rarise. Rarise. There we go. <laughs> uh, Okay, Duke Nuvan, since you are the oldest, you get to now move. Congratulations! Oh look, you found the Dodomingo. Hello, Mr. Dodomingo! Hi! Can I change your UI? No, I can't. He is getting an old, though. Poor little Dodomingo, I'm sorry. I tried to eat you, sir, and you were delicious. Okay, let's do that. Hi, Mr. Bunny Rabbit! How you doing? Oh, I can't click you. Darn. Okay. And we have Mianala here, who's just watching out for our pack. She's just kind of there. Doesn't really know what else to do. That's okay. Hmm. Alright, and let's see. Oh, hello. Hello, Van Van. Let's move you right here into our cluster of children. <laughs> and... We have a new baby girl who is also Miana. Yay! Oh, yeah, there we go. That's Miana. <laughs> so Miana the second. Hello. She is five speed, two collecting, three strength. Yep, just like the original Miana. <laughs> That's really funny, actually. Wow. Huh, what are the odds? Now she has A and G. Hmm. She does have those uh, beautiful horns just like the original Miana, except she's got stripes and beautiful striking blue eyes. It's gorgeous. Oh, well, welcome to the pack, Miana. How about you? What are you? This is Taduk, and I know we've had that name before. I'm not sure where, but I know I've heard it. <laughs> oh, and they're both striped. How adorable. I just love the stripes. Ugh. Let's see. And he's got Miyagi D and B. He's also got those blue eyes in the mutations, um, hidden away. And he's four, three, and three. Very good, very good, very good children. I'm very surprised, I suppose. But it's a good surprise. Let's see. We could also have Duke Nu or Vanaduke move. They're about the same age. Hmm. I really want to breed someone with those violet eyes, though. I really want to see what they look like. And Rare Ace is double immunity. However, maybe we can uh, keep her with Duke Nu. 
or hmm I really want her to mate with someone who's definitely got those purple eyes and it looks like Kukir Van can also be uh, that person hmm she's four three and three so it doesn't matter which one she specifically has but she's got the berry paw so, horns or <laughs> ram horns? Huh. I don't think we have enough spotted children, so you know what? Maybe we'll do that. He's got dots. She also has stripes in hers. So... Yeah. Okay. So we'll have these two be our next mating pair. And it looks like she will take only a little bit, so we're gonna mark her now. And I know that we have... Maisie over here, and I know that she's, you know, she got pregnant from a horny male, so let's see what she got. She has Kirduknu, who is G and F, so I don't think that horny male passed on his genes completely. He's 4, 1, and 1, so we knew that there was probably going to be something from there. It wasn't going to be great, but you know what? It was kind of worth the risk, just to see what exactly could we produce. And because of this little male here, I'm actually going to move him over here, closer to Maisie, because she is getting old. And we could probably have another pair go over there. I'm not exactly sure who. I know Ricola did accidentally get pregnant by a horny male as well, though. Hmm. I don't think we want anybody that's got the G trait. So anyone that has Gs, we're going to go ahead and you know, toss them out for right now because we want somebody who definitely doesn't. Uh, hmm. You know, Vanaduke and Mianala could produce something very interesting. In fact, so much so that I would really be up for that. There's also Rare, who does have F and B. But I think most of our pack has the, that F gene. Yeah. Oh, I'm so sorry, Precious. Let me see. Well, Kiriku doesn't. Hmm. There's also Duke Nguyen who doesn't either. Or Kuta. Who has D and B. What did you have, my dear? Oh, that's right. You had B as well. Hmm. I really want him to mate with someone. I know his children will be amazing. I just don't know who we can mate him with. We can mate him with Korra, but I want someone really strong. Hmm. Do you think it'd be worth it, guys? No, Mianala has those blind eyes, so we can't have her. If we do it, we definitely have to make sure that, you know, whoever has normal eyes. Hmm. You know what? Okay, so we're gonna stick Kuta and Rare together. I think that's a good plan for right now. And then maybe we can have him mate with... And then we can have Vanaduke and Mianala as well. Although Mianala's getting old. I know that. So we've got a little bit of time before Kosi goes too. And Mianna. Yeah, I think that'll be alright. Oh, I hear a predator. <laughs> and there is a lot of uh, swishing around in that grass. I don't know, guys. I don't know. Alright, we'll, we'll put Kiro Kir here and you know what? That that Dodomingo is just enjoying himself right there. He's just like, yeah, no. This is fine. <laughs> this is okay. I like it right here. Well, Mr. Dodomingo, I have to sorry or tell you sorry, but I'm gonna go ahead and do that so I can eat you later, okay? Hmm. Yep, they're still moving over there. Okay, so that's definitely where that predator was. Go, Maisie and Cece. <laughs> Maisie and Cece. That's really cute. And we'll move Kuta over there, and Kirduknu, how about we just sit you right here on there? 
since we don't really have any other use for you at the moment. Since you're just a little baby, you can't do much. That's okay. Oh, a lot of shuffling of these babies. Okay, come on, Nianna, the second. <laughs> we'll stick you right there so your mother can go ahead and feast upon everything else. And rare, I do want to scooch you over now so that Kuta doesn't die yet. But I think you can pick those berries just once before you get out of here. Whew. And you know what? We can have Taduk sit right there for you. He can collect. Do that. She's all ready to go ahead and be mated with. Thank you, Mianna the first. Hmm, a lot of our babies are actually really, really well set. I know that I do want Van Van to go ahead and mate with someone just because I love those poison fangs and I feel like they could really make a difference in our pack. I don't really know who he could mate with though because he does have G and F which are the most common traits <laughs> that we have so I don't know if really it would be wise for him to mate with anyone at that point. Hmm. But we can try and we can see because we want this immunity A to still be a thing. So you know what? I think we were gonna put who? Macy with Vanaduk. Vanaduk, actually, you can move that way, sweetheart. And me and Nala, you can start making your way over here, sweetie. Uh, yes. And Kuta was gonna mate with Rare. That's right. Okay. I've got to, like, make a little note of this to myself. <laughs> and it looks like Kosi's going to be the next one to die, I think. Yeah, it's definitely going to be Kosi. So we've got a little bit of time before Dukenu and Rarys can mate. And hopefully they'll produce a couple more female children, so that way we can pair a couple of these kids up. <laughs> Alright, let's skip the day. Mm-hmm. <laughs> pick up that, and this, and this, and this, and that. Thank you so much. Thank you, Kiro Kier. You've been very nice to us. Hello, Mr. Bunny. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, you ate some of our food. That's why you were right there. Silly Bun Bun. Oh, you silly bunny. Okay, may you see? Thank you so much, my dear. You've been very good to us. You as well, Cece. You as well. And where is... Ah, oh, there's our deer. Let's mark this really quick. So it was going to be rare and... Kuta. Okay. Kuta can actually meet her right there. We'll actually scoop a little closer that way we know for sure that they can be a, uh, a pair before they expire. And let's see, we had Van Duke, who is B and D. He does have that blind eyes trait hidden away, but he's 5, 2, and 3, so he's pretty much as normal as they come. Yeah. So that's, that's our normal in this pack, just 5, 2, and 3, or somewhere like it. Oh, sorry Mr. Bunny, but you are mine. And you are delicious. Uh, Duke Nuvan, how about we just scoot you a little ways off? That way we can make sure that there's nothing going on in this grass. Hwa! Oh, just a rock. <laughs> okay. And Vanaduke, you are very, very well, doll, and you're good. I don't know what I'm gonna do with you, but I will find something, my dear. Is that something bad? No. Okay, it's just a, it's just a chestnut. <laughs> okay. So we know that these two are gonna take over for these two. So let's move them closer here. And we'll just have her be pregnant for a little bit. And we can slowly move the more of the children this way. So let's see who we got. We have Kuvan, who is G and F. 
four, three, and three. Very good, very good. And he's got those beautiful spots like his father. And Ceresi, who is also four, three, and three, and she's got lovely, lovely stripes. Hmm, she got D and B. Okay, okay, not bad, not bad at all. Mm -hmm. And who did Mianala give birth to? Oh, that's right, Van Duke. Okay. So we can keep on going on. I'm gonna move Van Duke right back here so he can definitely make sure that nothing is out there ready to terrorize our pack mates. Oh, nut fell a little bit further than usual. That's okay. Just pick that up. And Van Duke, how about you sit right here with your friend? I guess is what we can call him. <laughs> All right, Ease. I think this might be your second to last, if not your last. Oh yeah, no, it's definitely gonna be her second to last before she uh, dies. Oh, I'm sorry, dear. I'm sorry. You are very good to us, though. And in fact, I think Cece can go ahead and take your place, my love. And you can kind of just wander around. I know you probably want to do that. At least a little. So Cece, how about you get over here, my dear? And you can stay right there. Cure Duke New. He's just kind of doing his own thing. He's got that adorable little spit snout. Yeah, we don't want that dying out in our pack. I think the spit snouts are very cute. And they've got very interesting genes, I would say something that I do want to keep going on in the line. That big nose too. I know that some of us might have it, other ones probably don't. Yeah, like these two don't have the big nose and I think... I think the big nose might actually die out soon because all of our babies have horns. So it's a lot harder to go ahead and keep it within the line. Even so though, it's okay. I still think the big nose is very beautiful, and maybe we'll find, you know, maybe it'll pop back up. Who knows? A lot of the nichelings actually do have the big nose hidden away somewhere. I know they do. If not, they also have the poison fangs. We can break the big nose back in, should we feel like it. Hmm. Ben, 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 who was your father and mother? Hmm. Had to be somebody with big noses, I'm sure. <laughs> but nobody else seems to have gotten it, so that's why I was kind of like, what? It's a bit interesting. Okay. Alright, let's skip the day, guys. Mm, I hear another lovely predator friend. <laughs> and I think that might be him. If that is, though, we are prepared. Oh, nope, just a bunny. Okay. Well, thank you, Reis. You were very helpful to us, no matter what. Oh, okay, so it might be... Who's over lurking over that way? Who's lurking here next to Ricola? Yup, it is a mean old predator. Okay, well, we'll move Duke Nuvan just over here. So that way he can make sure... And he can keep watch for us. Van Van Van, this will be your last turn, my love. Thank you so much for protecting your pack. You've done it well. We'll just do that. I can't exactly see over there, so I'm kind of tempted. Oh, okay, I see. Whoops, sorry, Mr. Bunny. <laughs> Not today. Oh, it's right rare. Who did you have? Van Duke. Four, one, and three. I don't think he got that claw. No, instead he actually inherited that no paw gene. But he's also inherited something else. The toxic body, which is rather interesting. I didn't even know that Kuta had this. Wow. Huh. Well, okay. That's really cool. You know what? Maybe we can breed him with someone and we will get that toxic body. Who's to say? Who's to say? And we'll move her here. Thank you, Rare. So that way we can maybe find somebody. Maybe find something, you know? Maybe we can get that claw to breed in. Just a, just a little. 
Maybe we can get that claw to get into our line. And if not, that's fine too. Um, I don't want to move any babies over here because I know they might get sick a lot faster than our other children. So, we'll kind of keep them away from right now. And Macy, what do we do with you, my love? We'll just slowly move you over here. Okay. <laughs> And now, who do we have? We have Kuroku. I think that's the first time I've heard that name. He's got five speed, two collecting, three strength. The normal, the normal. He's got G and F, so definitely very normal. Because he's got maybe one or two babies left. It's a little hard to say. And we also have Kiro, who has D and F. He's also got that blind eyes trait, sadly. Yeah, he definitely does. In fact, so much so that I kind of want to make sure that we don't get it. So I'm going to put the uh, normal eyes here in our mutation menu. And let's see, Kira, what are you? Five, two, and three. Yep. Hmm. I know that my babies probably are not the... I know they don't look that different <laughs> as a lot of people might like. However... I just really love the ram horns, and I know we get weird little bouts of things, just like Van Van here. So who knows, you know what, maybe we will find something really cool, eventually. Eventually. You know what? This nest here has been a nest of just trial and error and experimentation, and I think I kind of want to keep that up. So much so that we might put Van Van and Mianna over there. They both have the violet eyes in their recessive. So I don't see why not. I know that they have, let's see, he has GF and she's got GA. But perhaps maybe we can get another double G baby. So if that's the case, I'm going to mark them down. And we are definitely going to go ahead and have our own little experimentation ring going on. <laughs> Just because I'm very curious if we can maybe breed in that uh, those fangs and maybe a little bit more strength into our family. So let's do that. We'll set them there and then all of our kids are just kind of everywhere at the moment. I know we have Kukirvan here who's probably like, hey, but why not us? Oh, Otaku. Ah, that's right, DNF. Okay, I see. Hmm. Alright, alright. I think we're good. I think we're set. We can keep going. Yeah? I'm pretty sure. And I know that mean predator is over there. That's why I'm kind of bringing everyone there. Slowly but surely. So maybe he'll pop out. Or maybe he'll just leave us alone. Who's to say? Oh, nope, he's definitely still there. <laughs> I was really hopeful that he would just leave us alone, but he is not in for that right now. Uh, hmm. Okay. Vanaduk, how about we move you this way? And then we can co put Kukirvan, I guess. Yeah, we'll put Kukir Van back on here, so no predators just randomly pop up. Cause that's always a very terrifying sight. <laughs> we'll do this, and we'll have him pick from these berries. Kiro, you can move over here. Have her mate pick those berries. Mm-hmm. And we run a tight little ship, don't we? And we can move Vanaduk. We'll move him right here for right now. I know that Rare is still pregnant, so we can sit her there. Hello, Mr. Rabbit. No, that used to be a rabbit. <laughs> that used to be. Okay. 
Macy, if you could please just provide us... Oh, wow. There was a little rabbit hole there. I didn't notice that. Hmm. Well, maybe we can put Van Duke over there. He's got really nothing to do at the moment, so I don't see why not. And we can have you collect and sit right here for me. Okay. I think since everyone is done collecting, we can end the day more or less yeah i definitely want to keep an adult there i don't know if there might be a bird so <laughs> i don't want to take that risk with that being said uh i think that will be the end of the episode so thank you all for watching bye hey guys it's Linksy, and it looks like you made it to the end of the episode meaning now we get to go ahead and announce the winners i'm so excited so let's get started so this part right here, this subscriber button, which is probably hidden underneath the bandy cam because my other recording software does not like to record the <laughs> what's actually on my screen. It only records the games. So I was like, okay, we'll just get bandy cam. It's whatever. But this tab right here is what I'm going to be switching to. So if there's ever an edit, that's what that is. And it's just me making sure that you did subscribe. That's it. That's all it is. So... I don't really want to put it out there just in case, you know, people are like, oh no, well you've only been subscribed for an hour, so you shouldn't get it, which is completely wrong, okay? I don't want that going on at all. I don't care if you are a new subscriber from a minute ago to being a subscriber from all the way back when I first started my singing videos, which was like three years ago. <laughs> You are still a subscriber to me, and I still adore you, even if you aren't a subscriber and you're just viewing. You know, you are still a human being. I'm going to treat you with that dignity and respect. So should everyone else. And everyone likes free stuff. That's not a bad thing. <laughs> okay, so let's get started. So our first number, and I have the numbers written down from everyone that's chosen, so I'm pretty sure I didn't leave anybody out, but just in case, we're going to go ahead and click that so we can find the number if we need to. So let's get started. Alright, number 30. I don't... Oh no, we did have someone. We did have somebody choose number 30, so who was it? Okay, that's going into Jesse Muse. And... Oh, what? I'm pretty sure I wrote down somebody that had the number 30, right? So it was... Let's see, that's number 99. Oh, hold on. That's top comments. That's why I can't find anything. There we go. All right. 63, 88, 44, 26, 7, 30. All right. Here's our first winner. Yeah, I knew I found somebody with number 30. I don't know why I didn't list it here, but okay. It's a good thing I did write these numbers down. So, Shadow Dawn, it looks like you are our first winner. You are subscribed to me. So, Shadow Dawn, you are our winner. Thank you very much for playing. You know, I'm really excited to go ahead and give you your Steam code for Niche. All right, let's get started on the next one. Number 54. Let me check. I don't recall anyone having number 54. I'm going to go ahead and look, and no. Nope, I don't think anyone had number 54. Let me make sure. No. Okay. No number 54. All right, next one. 70. Uh, no, I don't think I had a number 70. And I'm sorry if you hear weird creaking, that's my chair. I totally need a new one. <laughs> no, no number 70. Okay. Next. 23. I know we had a 25. I don't think we had 23, though. It doesn't look to be like we did. Uh, where is that? Nope, that's highlighting Sari's <laughs> niche. So that's not it. And that's highlighting Jesse Mia's. So no, no number 23 either. Dang. It's okay, we will find someone who's got our next one. 12. Now I remember reading 
11 and 13, but nobody took the number 12, I think. No, I don't think anyone took it. All right, that's that video 12 hours ago. Chessy Muse. <laughs> um, where is the highlight? Oh, no. That's for an Overwatch video. And the fifth one, I think, is highlighting something else. I wish I could like point you into the direction where it is going. I can just see just barely the little highlights on the videos that's around here on my recommended. But nope. No number 12. 47. I feel like someone must have chosen that number. Yes, actually, someone did choose it. I specifically remember our very first, <laughs> the first person who commented, Meow Anonymous. Hello! Looks like you have been chosen to go ahead and get it. So let me see. Yep, there I am. Okay. <laughs> so Meow Anonymous, you have specifically been chosen as well as... Who? Oh gosh. Shadow Dawn, I remember. Okay, I remember these names. At least these ones I will remember. <laughs> so let me go ahead and circle their names here to say hey. 44 and it was number 30 I believe too. I mean 47. There we go. 47. All right. Last steam code. Let's see. Number 31. I don't think anyone actually got 31. So let me check. That's three. No. Hmm. No. Okay, no 31. Let's keep hoping, guys. 75. No, I don't think anybody chose 75 either. No, definitely not. Okay. 91. Nope, no 91. Not that I remember. I know we had a 99. <laughs> no, no 91. 21. Mm, I don't think we had a 21 either. Oh gosh, all of this is just making me crazy. <laughs> uh, no. Don't, nope. Not 21 either. 50. Now I know we chose somebody that has that number. 50. Where'd they go? Emily Corona! Thank you so much! So you have been chosen by the lucky random number gods for our last steam code of niche. Yep, and uh, there I am over here. All right, so there we go, guys. I'm sorry to anybody who, or to those who didn't win. I know it's a little sad. <laughs> if I could, I would tell the niche developers, hey, could I have a couple more codes? But I feel like that's taking a little too much. You know, this game is about... Oh, how much? Like $20 in the Steam store right now? I can't remember. Let me see. If we go into the store and go look for niche. Yeah. So niche is about 18 to or $19. So about 20 really. Okay, I got cut off there a little bit. Sorry about that, guys. But uh, there we go. There's our people. That's that's what's been chosen. So thank you very much everybody for uh, Joining in. Thank you for subscribing and if you're leaving because you didn't win that's fine, too You know what? I don't mind. I'm glad that you at least had the fun and participating and That's all I really want. You know, I want people to enjoy my content or whatever I do I'm glad that it can make you smile if that or help you fall asleep I know some people do use it as white noise <laughs> I find that a little bit interesting. So thank you everyone for joining. Bye!